2023 was a major anniversary for the Endangered Species Act. It's now 50 years old. With historian Douglas Sprinkley, we mark a milestone. When Theodore Roosevelt was president, he lamented that the North American bison, once 40 million strong, had been nearly wiped out by commercial hunters. An avid bird watcher, Roosevelt also mourned the fact that hunting and habitat loss had killed some three billion passenger pigeons in the 19th century alone, driving the species to extinction. Roosevelt roared from his bully pulpit, the wildlife in its habitat cannot speak, so we must and we will. It would take another six decades though before the United States caught up with Roosevelt, but when it did, it went big. On December 28, 1973, Richard Nixon put his presidential signature to the far-reaching Endangered Species Act, which for the first time provided America's iconic flora and fauna with serious legal protection. The remarkable success of the Endangered Species Act is undisputable. An astonishing 99% of the threatened species first listed have survived. Due to the heroic efforts of U.S. government employees, Bald eagles now nest unmolested along the Lake Erie shoreline. Grizzlies roam Montana's wilderness, and alligators propel themselves menacingly across Louisiana's bayous. Whether it's protecting a tiny Kirtland's warbler in the Jack Pines of Michigan, or a 200-ton blue whale in the Santa Barbara Channel, the Endangered Species Act remains the most dazzling and impactful environmental feat of all time. In Northern California, the Yurok tribe has successfully reintroduced the California condor back to its ancestral lands. Recently, a federal judge approved the reintroduction of gray wolves in Colorado. And while America is still mourning musician Jimmy Buffett, his conservation legacy lives on with the Save the Manatee Club in Florida. Upon reflection, what President Nixon said in 1973 still holds true. Nothing is more priceless and more worthy of preservation than the rich array of animal life with which our country has been blessed.